Hello everyone, my name is Krista and today I'm going to be making the soft yeast dinner rolls found on page 954 of our on cooking textbook. So I decided to make the recipe only do 16 rolls instead of 64. So these are the measurements and ingredients that you will need. We have six ounces of warm water, 15 grams of active dry yeast, 330 grams of bread flour, 7.5 grams of salt, 15 grams of non-fat dry milk powder, 30 grams of sugar, 15 grams of shortening, 15 grams of unsalted butter softened, and then 25 grams of egg. You will also need egg wash, but that's kind of as needed for brushing the top of the rolls. I also, for materials, have a big mixing bowl, a spatula, and then a, another greased bowl so that we can proof the dough. The first step is to combine the water and the active dry yeast into a small bowl. The next step is to combine all the other ingredients into a large mixing bowl. I have my bread flour, the egg, the butter, the shortening, the salt, the sugar, and the non-fat dry milk powder and you're going to want to combine these. All right, so this is what your mixture should look like. And next you're going to add the yeast and water mixture into it. You then want to stir to combine until it becomes a dough. All right, this next part is me kneading the dough and I decided to speed it up because I did 10 minutes of it. Then you want to place the dough in the grease bowl, cover it and let it rise till double in size. Then punch the dough down. Then using a scale measure out 38 gram size little dough balls and place them on the baking sheet. This is what they should look like. You will then let the dough balls double in size. You will put the egg wash on them and then bake them at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 12 to 15 minutes. They should come out of the oven looking golden brown. Then you will want to place them on a cooling rack. All right, it's been a little bit. I've let the yeast rolls cool down and I decided to cut one in half, and this is what they look like. I hope you guys enjoyed.